What's up? Welcome. You may be wondering, Bogdan, what year is it today? Well, the answer is simple. It's the year of the moth, baby! Like Moths to Flames has just dropped a new track called Soul Exchange. They said on Twitter that this is the final track off of their new album they came out a few months ago called The Cycles of Trying to Go, which I think to be one of the best albums of this year. If you haven't listened to it yet, do yourself a favor, you're gonna fucking love it. This is a follow-up single uh, that's basically concluding this album. From what I understand, it's called Soul Exchange. It's got a music video. It just dropped out of nowhere, out of thin blue air. This kind of reminds me of what, uh, you know, what happened with Heavener. Uh, we got the Heavener title track after the album came out. Um, not exactly the same because this one is not called The Cycles of Trying to Cope. But anyways, let's jump in. Stop talking. Stop talking, Bogdan. Stop yapping. Let's do it. Like Monster Flames. This guy sounds like old moths. Goddamn. Oh yes, baby. Oh yes, this is the moths. This is the moths I fucking remember. Oh yes, oh my god, this post chorus. God damn! This this could have been the best song on the album if it was included. It's got that like early moths vibe as well, which I really like. Beautiful. Beautiful. Like moths to flames. Soul exchange. Goddamn. Well, that was the final concluding track of the cycles of trying to cope. Uh, Soul exchange by like moths to flames. What a release. What a out of nowhere little music video we just got from them. Obviously, the song still very much captures the uh, the sound of the cycles of trying to cope. The sound of that beautiful album. If it was included in the album, this could have been one of the one of the best songs off of it because of you know it's just a really really well made song. It's a it's a really nice intense energetic track from like Moths to Flames. It's got some nice little breakdowns. It's got the signature chaotic nature to their music at this point. Uh, it did remind me a little bit of uh, some of their earlier albums, maybe not like the earliest, but certainly, you know, the era in the mid tens, like uh, An Eye for an Eye, maybe, um, what was it, We Don't Exist, uh, When We Don't Exist. Uh, it's a little bit of that essence I felt through this song, which is really nice. Um, 
I, th I, okay, so here's the thing. I have been thinking about making a series where I just kind of go back and do a little retrospect, if you want to call it, of uh, different bands. And like Monster Flames was always a band I was going to do first uh, because it's always so interesting to me how like Moths to Flames has existed for, you know, like, um, I don't know, 13, 14 years, uh, maybe longer. Uh, but, you know, their first release was in 2011. And they've been fucking going at it, album after album after album that are all fucking amazing. And people don't really seem to know them. Like, like yeah, sure, they're, they're not a small band by any means, but they, they always, they, they kind of failed to... To capture that metalcore mainstream, if you know what I mean. You know, they always mention these bands, like the big four, the big three, whatever the fuck. Like, Moss of Flames almost never comes up in those conversations, and it's always so surprising to me because of how much high-quality music they've put out over the years. This album being one of them, this album being one of the more overlooked ones this year, again. Which makes me very sad, makes me very... Um, like, what, what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? This song was awesome. It serves as a nice little conclusion to this uh, little era of, like, Moths to Flames. Um, it's not as grandiose or, like, explosive or crazy as, you know, you might expect the final track to be. But it was a nice song, um, nonetheless. Nice staple of the cycles of trying to cope. Um, I liked it. I liked it. It was nice and, you know, it was nice and, and fast. And it's got some some breakdowns, but that was uh, that was like Master Flames, Soul Exchange. What do you guys think of this? I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments down below. Let me know how much you love the Moth. Uh, but that is all for this one. That is all for a Soul Exchange by like Master Flames. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you liked spending time with me. I appreciate you certainly for doing so. If you want to stay, subscribe. I'm here every day bringing you some more music for your playlists. But that is all. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all. Drink some water, eat a snack, or a proper lunch or dinner, or whatever time it is. Uh, but I'll be on my way. And so are you. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.